Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Daily Fresh Manor. Today we are looking at the second watch, which is 9 p.m. to 12 a.m. This is a time for intercession as we pray for others, we pray for our communities, the world, and also we ask God for intervention and to intercede for our needs and personal concerns as we humble ourselves before God, asking him to move his mighty, mighty right hand. We're looking at scriptures today, a few scriptures. First, Timothy chapter 2, verses 1 to 4. I urge you, first of all, to pray for all people. Ask God to help them and intercede on their behalf and give thanks for them. Pray this way for kings and all who are in authority so that we can live in peaceful and quiet lives marked by godliness and dignity. This is good and pleases God, our Savior, who wants everyone to be saved and to understand the truth. Ephesians 6, verses 18. Pray in the Spirit at all times and on every occasion. Staying alert and be persistent in your prayers for all believers everywhere. James 5, 16. Confess your sins to each other and pray for each other so that you may be healed. You see, the earnest prayer of a righteous person has great power and produces wonderful results. Matthew 5, 44 to 45, Jesus teaches, But I say, love your enemies. Pray for those who persecute you. In that way, you will be acting as true children of your Father in heaven. For he gives his sunlight to both the evil and the good. And he sends rain on the just and on the unjust alike. Psalm 113, verse 4. For the Lord is high above the nations, and his glory is higher than the heavens. Psalm 67, verse 2 to 4. May your ways be known throughout the earth, your saving power among people everywhere. May the nations praise you, O God. Yes, may all the nations praise you. Let the whole world sing for joy, because you govern the nations with justice and guide the people of the whole world. Psalm 72, verse 12. He will rescue the poor when they cry to him. He will help the oppressed who have no one to defend them. Psalm 16, verses 1 to 2. And 7 to 11. Keep me safe, O God, for I have come to you for refuge. I said to the Lord, You are my master. Everything good that I have comes from you. I will bless the Lord who guides me even at night. My heart instructs me. I know the Lord is always with me. I will not be shaken, for he is right beside me. No wonder my heart is glad, and I rejoice. My body rests in safety, for you will not leave my soul among the dead or allow your Holy One to rot in the grave. You will show me the way of life, granting me the joy of your presence and the pleasures of living with you forever. Amen. May you be blessed this day, and may you use these prayers at some point in time during your day. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. God bless you. Bye-bye.